Hi guys, and welcome to my channel. Today I have for you a relatively common, but not so simple brain teaser. For one reason or another, lots of people end up getting the solution to this question wrong. So let's see if you can succeed where others have failed. A bat and a ball together cost $1.10. The bat costs $1 more than the ball. How much does the ball cost? You can pause this video to give yourself some time to figure out the solution and go ahead and add your answer to the comments section below and then come right back to see if you were right. No cheating. While you guys are thinking about the solution, if you can just take a few seconds to click the subscribe button if you haven't already done so, and please do hit the like button, which really helps with the YouTube algorithm. You're back? Still not too late to pause the video if you're still working on your solution. But if you've already got that in place, here we go. The baseball and ball together is $1.10. And if we assume the ball is 10 cents and the baseball bat is $1 more than the ball, then $1 more than 10 cents is $1.10, which is equal to the total. That's perfect, right? Problem solved. Except for the fact that the problem was solved incorrectly. So what exactly went wrong? Everything seemed to add up perfectly. Well, sometimes the simplest solution is not necessarily the correct solution. Like in this case. If the bat is $1 and the ball is 10 cents, if we subtract the price of the bat from the price of the ball, we get $1 minus 10 cents, which is 90 cents. But the question clearly states that the bat is $1 more than the ball and not 90 cents more than the ball. What happened here is that your brain played a little trick on you. Your brain automatically subtracted $1 from the total cost, which is $1 and 10 cents, and fooled you into believing that the ball was actually 10 cents. In this case, if the ball was 10 cents and the bat was $1 more than the ball, then the bat itself without the ball would be $1.10. cents. The combined total would therefore be $1.10 cents plus 10 cents, which would be $1.20 cents, which is not the correct total. So what is the correct answer? To start with, the brain teaser assumes that both the bat and the ball have some monetary value associated with them, so therefore neither are free. Having said that, the total cost of both items is $1.10, which implies that the bat has to be at least $1. So there are only three possible solutions for the price of the bat. The first option is that the bat is $1, but in order to be $1 more than the ball, the ball would have to be free because any value to the ball would have to bump up the value of the bat accordingly and this would not be a valid solution. Next, we will assume that the bat is $1.10, and if it is, the ball would have to be $0.10, cents, and hopefully by now, after watching the previous example, we know the ball cannot be $0.10. Cents. This leaves us with the final and correct solution. The bat is $1.05, and to be $1 more than the ball, the ball would have to be $0.05. Cents. The total cost of the bat and the ball would be $1.05 plus $0.05, cents, which would give a grand total of $1.10. And there you have it. Now once again, if you enjoy these type of videos, please do subscribe and turn notifications on and prepare to have your brain challenged.